and speak at conferences all the time and I never get tired because they create this microcosm of community where you get to network, innovate, and communicate with your peer as well as your fiercest competitor. When we look at networking as what we can do for others, that's when it becomes valuable. That's when it becomes positive. That's when it becomes powerful. It's not about what I can get from you, but what I can do for you. We don't have to be in an office or a boardroom. We just have to be with one or more people around us. Nothing is optional. It's all an opportunity. It's your chance to, as I like to say, share your challenges, search for solutions, and celebrate success. To find the key to opening our next dream and that of someone else's. I truly believe that it's when we help others, we achieve ourselves. Now there is a fine line, I must remind you, between networking and stalking. Sometimes it's worth asking yourself, is it cocktail talk or your cocktail talking? Office jokes aren't funny the day after, so you can't remember them. Enjoy the mood you're in and it will be contagious because when we're positive, we empower and when we are positive, we elicit a positive response. When we better know who we are, we better know what we can give. Whether a steak dinner, D-scoop, a burger joint or our own homes, we can be powerful. We can be networking.